Feast of Immaculate Conception. Feast days are the best days to ask for your requests. As we celebrate the Feast of Immaculate Conception, may all your prayers be answered. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Please state your intentions for this feast day celebration. Most Holy Virgin, who was pleasing to the Lord, and became His Mother, immaculate in body and spirit, in faith and in love, look kindly on the wretched, who implore Thy powerful patronage. The wicked serpent, against whom was hurled the first curse, continues fiercely, to attack and ensnare the unhappy children of Eve. Do Thou then, O Blessed Mother, our Queen and Advocate, who from the first instant of Thy conception, didst crush the head of the enemy, Receive the prayers which, united with thee in our single heart, we implore thee, to present at the throne of God, that we may never fall into the snares which are laid out for us, and may all arrive at the port of salvation. And in so many dangers, may the Church and Christian society, sing once again, the hymn of deliverance, and of victory, and of peace, Amen. In thy conception, O Virgin Mary, thou wast immaculate, Pray for us to the Father, whose Son, Jesus Christ, conceived of the Holy Ghost, thou didst bring forth. The Pope's Prayer for the Immaculate Conception O Mary, our Immaculate Mother, on your feast day I come to you, and I come not alone, I bring with me, all those with whom your Son entrusted to me, in this city of Rome and in the entire world, that you may bless them and preserve them from harm. I bring to you mother, children, especially those who are alone, abandoned, and for this reason, are tricked and exploited. I bring to you mother, families, who carry forward life and society, with their daily and hidden efforts. In a special way, the families who struggle the most, for their many internal and external problems. I bring to you mother, all workers, both men and women, and I entrust to you, especially those who, out of need, are forced to work in an unworthy profession, and those who have lost work, or are unable to find it. We are in need of your immaculate gaze, to rediscover the ability, to look upon persons and things, with respect and awareness, without egotistical or hypocritical interests. We are in need of your immaculate heart, to love freely, without secondary aims, but seeking the good of the other, with simplicity and sincerity, renouncing masks and tricks. We are in need of your immaculate hands, to caress with tenderness, to touch the flesh of Jesus, in our poor, sick, or despised brethren, to raise up those who have fallen, and support those who waver. We are in need of your immaculate feet, to go toward those who know not how to make the first step, to walk on the paths of those who are lost, to find those who feel alone, we thank you, O Mother, because in showing yourself to us, you free us of all stain of sin, you remind us, that what comes first, is the grace of God, the love of Jesus Christ, who gave his life for us, the strength of the Holy Spirit, which renews all things. Let us not give in to discouragement, but trusting in your constant help, let us engage ourselves fully, in renewal of self, of this city, and of the entire world, pray for us, Holy Mother of God, Amen. Prayer to Our Lady of the Immaculate Conception O Most Holy Virgin, Immaculate in body and spirit, look kindly on me, as I implore your powerful intercession. O Most Holy Mother, receive my prayers, as I present them to God. Please state your intentions. O Mary, Mother of Jesus and our Mother, you intercede for us with your Son, O Mary conceived without sin, pray for us who have recourse to thee, Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth, as it is in heaven. Give us this day, our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil, Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen.
In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.